just wrapped up the Broncos 13th training camp practice watched it with former Denver Bronco and we have the insight the three biggest takeaways first Russ is on fire he continues to stack days and today best practice of camp by far didn't have a single incompletion and he's going deep he's going short taking the check downs also hitting first reads so good to see yeah he's really looking good he's taking advantage of the plays that he's given and as sean payton continues to open up that playbook he's getting better and better and better i just look forward to seeing russell continue to improve on his days and continue to stack and have great days Cortland Sutton was his favorite target today. Hit him on about a 30-yard pass where Pat Sertan is in smothering coverage at the very last second. Cortland gets some separation, makes a great catch. Probably would have been drilled pretty hard by P.J. Locke, but still held on to it. Next play that's thrown to him, Damari Mathis in great coverage. Cortland still makes a catch, and then he ends practice with a touchdown from Russell Wilson. Todd, Cortland... Looks like he's got your arms now. Yeah, that's my man. Targets, targets, targets. Cortland needs tons of targets this year because he's making the plays. He's showing you that he could be the number one wide receiver for this team. Him and Jerry Judy really playing in tandem with each other. I think will be great, but he needs his targets because he can really make the plays that count. And finally, some news coming out of Arizona the past 24 hours that the game field that the Broncos are playing their first preseason game on this Friday is a little questionable. A lot of players slipping. Marlon Mack suffered an Achilles injury yesterday. Some people said that was because of the rough playing conditions. And after practice today, Sean Payton said that's not going to impact who plays or who doesn't play. It may impact what type of cleats they wear, though. Yeah, I think they should take care of their players, make sure they're safe. There's nothing worse than playing on a bad field, similar to like the Raiders, where half the field used to be a baseball field. Nobody wants to be <laughs> in that situation. Nobody wants to get hurt because of the turf or the, or the surface that you're playing on. So make sure those guys are taken care of. I hope they do. Next step. Month are the first preseason game this Friday night.